are you doing? So I'm on my way on a vacation because it's been a horrible semester and I'm fed up and I just want to leave. So nowadays travelers all around the world are interested in qualitative experiences. The Condé Nast Traveler provides a big range of useful information for those who have the passion for traveling, like me. So just imagine you're planning your next vacation. Where would you like to go? What are the most interesting places that you could visit? And how can you get your, the best out of your holiday? You can find all of these informations in the Condé Nast Traveler. So Condé Nast Traveler has a customer-oriented marketing mix. The main customer need Condé Nast Traveler satisfies is the information and the inspiration on where to go on your next vacation. The key points of sale would be the different packages and different destinations that are featured and offered on the Condé Nast Traveler website. So the following challenges to market Condé Nast Travel magazine as a service is perishability. So Condé Nast Traveler needs to make sure that the customers are able to get this information and that it's new and fresh. And to do so, there's a, a team of journalists and uh, columnists who work very hard on that. So Condé Nast Traveler, compared to its competitors, does not follow trends, but it creates them. So CNT is one of the leaders in traveling journalism with 3.4 million unique users on their site. Um, perishability is thus not a real issue because the articles are still there, but they just lose relevancy. Well, as we know, today is the past of tomorrow, and in order to keep CNT business success, they need to be up to date not only with trends of traveling, but also changes in technology. Some studies may show that paper-based newspapers and magazines can connect better to the consumer's memory because it links their special memory networks. It also results in greater internalization of the ads. Some consumers prefer printed copies before it creates less strain to their eyes and uh, it gets to see more than one aspect. The future of CNC, the paper-based magazines, will be in high demand because of the, its luxury image and reputation. CNT can deliver their information and maintain their consumers by frequently posting on social media such as Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter. Customers are willing to pay a higher price to obtain specific information. That's why Condon and Travelers really focus on quality instead of quantity. And that's exactly the reason also why they do their own research. They always try to get the latest information to do up-to-date articles. So now we'll analyze the... But Alex, yes. what the hell is a SWOT analysis? So our group really analyzed the strength, the weakness, the opportunity and the oh. threats that uh, Condé Nast Traveler could actually have. As strengths, we'll see, they're always delivering influential content coming from a bit everywhere. Uh, the weakness, they're providing up-to-date articles, but they're always perishing. So that is really a threat, because now with technology, you can get up-to-date information at any time. Another thing that we could maybe improve would be an opportunity of offering more travel information or more travel packages because once you're reading an article about the destination, you're so interested in it that you might want to go straight away to it. CNT's primary target group are both leisure and business customers. They prefer high quality over quantity and are not interested in lower cost products and services. They usually eat out spending an average of 74 pounds per person and also dedicate a specific percentage of their budget on luxury items such as fashion, watches, jewelry, holidays and home improvements. For points of difference of Condé Nast Traveler magazine, what makes CNT unique is that they understand and know exactly what their customers want. They can provide the information of the lifestyle, brands and places that the customers are into. And as a lot of readers also use the website, CNT is capable of accumulating browsing data and with service surveys, CNTs can obtain secondary level information from the customers. This helps the others to know precisely what the customers are interested in and what information could be updated. Thank you for watching our video. I hope you have learned a lot about CNT and would want to become their customers. Have a nice day.